Tesla introduced their solar roof tiles in 2016, and while some predicted that they would replace the need for a conventional solar panel system, the technology has not quite lived up to expectations. You see, in 2016, when Tesla acquired SolarCity and rebranded the company to what is now Tesla Solar, people began to predict that the company would lead the solar industry in future innovation, which is quite predictably what happened. Not only two months after buying SolarCity for $2.6 billion, Elon Musk announced that Tesla Solar would be manufacturing a solar tile roof, essentially replacing the need for a traditional shingle or tile roof and replacing it with the solar tile roof that would not only protect the home from the elements as would a traditional roof, but also produce direct current electricity as would a solar panel, all while not differing too much in aesthetic from the looks of a standard roof. And while all of that sounded too good to be true for a homeowner, it was just that. Tesla began installing the first solar roof tile systems during the middle of 2020, four years after they initially presented the product. The solar roof tile would cost 25 to 50% over the market price for a standard solar PV system, and installations would be carried out by certified installers, essentially local roofing companies who would act as a subcontractor who have gone through Tesla's required training to become a licensed Tesla installation partner. Tesla's sales process varies greatly from that of a traditional solar company, essentially having you input your home's address on their website, followed by the average price that you pay each month for electricity, and then somehow predicting what size of a solar system you would need for your home and how much power that system would offset, despite not taking into account shading, nor ever asking you how many kilowatt hours of energy you use in the average year. Seems questionable. Though thanks to the success that Tesla experienced with Tesla Automotive, the brand reputation that the company developed led hundreds of homeowners purchasing these systems to see what they're all about. And the first thing that they began to experience was what is now known as a common occurrence amongst Tesla solar customers, poor customer service. Tesla is a large company, and it would be unfair for anybody to ask for perfect customer service. But with homeowners in some instances not being able to reach a member of the Tesla solar customer service team up to the day of install, people began to become frustrated. While going solar can be a fun and exciting process, there will likely be a lot of questions that you have leading up to install. And if you've paid a company in some instances upwards of six figures for a system, you deserve to at least speak to somebody on the phone who can answer a question for you without reading off a generic script that they've been given to say. Communication is necessary leading up to the installation of a solar PV system with inspections that need to get scheduled, utility and HOA applications that need to be filed. And without proper communication throughout the process, things can become delayed and problems can occur in the future. Leading into the technology itself, I think it's important that we take a step back and take a look into the product from a bird's eye view and analyze how the tiles themselves work and compete with a standard solar panel. Each Tesla solar tile will work similar to a solar panel and convert the PV energy that the sun shines into direct current energy. At that point, the DC energy will be sent into a central inverter, at which point it will be converted into alternating current. The drawback to the system is that there will always be a central point of failure within the system, being that if your central string inverter happens to fail, your entire system cannot produce power for your home until the inverter has been swapped out. And as we spoke about earlier regarding customer service, installation timelines, and also repair timelines that customers experience with Tesla Automotive, this could become a very long process. In my other videos, you may know that we talk about microinverters, which essentially grants each individual panel its own inverter, which has recently become the go-to option for a premier inverter solution thanks to its reliability, which Tesla is not able to offer. Tesla solar roof tiles come in two main types, PV modules and non-producing roofing tiles. Being that there will likely be areas of your roof in which would not make sense to put PV tiles, Tesla has what are called non-producing roofing tiles, which essentially match the aesthetic of a normal PV tile and blend into the solar roof. One of the main benefits of a Tesla solar tile roof is that it's more aesthetically pleasing than a traditional solar panel system. Being that the panels are incorporated into the tiles, they blend in with your roof rather than standing out as a separate addition. This can be especially appealing if you have a home with a unique or historical design that you don't want to compromise with a separate solar panel system. Another advantage of a Tesla solar tile roof is the durability. The tiles are made of tempered glass which is much stronger and more resistant to breakage than traditional asphalt shingles. This means that you won't have to worry about damage from hail or other debris, and the tiles are also resistant to fading and discoloration over time. And while after hearing about the benefits of the technology, you may be inclined to look into it, it's important that we first visit the price of this system. Tesla solar roofs average around the price of $6.49 a watt, 
which is more than double the cost of solar panels in certain markets. That price per watt will include the re-roofing expenses, which you will incur when installing a Tesla solar roof. And it's important that we briefly bring that expense up because when you file for your 30% federal tax credit, unfortunately, it will become an expense which is not eligible for the credit. As I spoke about in my video going over the 2023 federal tax credit for solar, PV solar systems will be eligible to receive a 30% tax credit as well as backup battery. However, re-roofing expenses related to installing a Tesla solar roof will not be applicable. The re-roofing expense to install a Tesla solar roof will typically cost anywhere from seven to $13,000, depending upon the square footage of your roof. With the payback period of a typical solar system being in the range of four to eight years, with the Tesla solar roof, you would be looking at a timeline of seven to 15 years to see your investment pay off. Now that we understand how a Tesla solar roof works and how much it might cost, what are the warranties that you're offered for the system? Warranties are one of the most important things that you're investing into when you're purchasing a solar system. They grant you protection in the case that one of the components of your system is not performing, which allows you the comfort to know that you will not have to incur additional expenses later down the road. Tesla offers a 25 year linear power warranty with a guaranteed production of 95% at year five and no less than 0.5% degradation per year for the remaining 20 years fairly competitive to what most panels are able to offer. Where things can get tricky are with the comprehensive system warranties. Tesla only offers a non-extendable 10-year warranty on their string inverter, which is drastically less than most leading inverter manufacturers. Additionally, Tesla's roof and leak warranty will only be 10 years, which is significantly shorter than the average 25 to 30 year warranty that a homeowner will be granted with a standard shingle roof. With a standard solar system, installation companies will offer a 25 year roof and leak warranty, which covers any section of the roof which panels will cover. If you're still considering a Tesla solar tile roof for your home, you may be wondering how long you can expect to see the installation timelines be. The installation process can vary based upon several factors, so it's difficult to give a definitive answer, but we'll do our best to provide an estimate. First, let's talk about the size of your roof. The larger your roof, the more Tesla solar tiles you'll need, and therefore, the longer that it'll take to install them. On average, a Tesla solar tile roof takes about one to two weeks to install, but this can vary depending upon the size and complexity of your roof. Being that Tesla will subcontract this installation out to a roofing partner who will service the installation based upon their availability, you can in some instances expect to see installation timelines anywhere from four months to a year. The process that Tesla will go through to service this installation will be similar to a standard solar installation company, being that they must pull permits, get HOA approval, and get permission to operate after the system has been installed. As of recently, Tesla canceled thousands of solar projects nationwide with signs of potential downsizing. So it's unclear where we could see this innovation heading. The idea is there, but the execution of a ROI friendly solar system that offers the same capabilities of a standard solar system is yet to be met. In conclusion, Tesla solar tiles offer a unique and innovative solution to homeowners looking to go solar. With their sleek design and durability, they can be a great option for those who value aesthetics and want a long lasting solar solution. It's important to keep in mind that Tesla solar tiles do come with a higher price tag than a traditional solar panel system, so be sure to carefully consider the cost and potential return on that investment before making the decision. If you're interested in learning more about Tesla solar tile roofs, we recommend doing your own research and speaking to a Tesla solar tile specialist to get a better understanding as to whether or not they're a good choice for your home. On this channel, we cover all things solar, so make sure to check out our other videos if you're interested in looking more into residential solar for your home. Again, my name is Jack, and I'll see you guys next time.